Hi everyone, Stock Mo here. Today's video is for entertainment purposes only, and hopefully we're gonna make some money with this entertainment. I'm gonna be going over the top stocks to buy now. These are ones that I think have a great chance to roll up some big gains in the next few weeks slash years. And of course, uh, if you stick around, I think you're gonna like what I got for you. For those who don't know me, I'm Stock Mo. I'm an old financial advisor and teacher. Now I do this YouTube thing. Now, all I ever ask, hit that subscribe button down below. Of course, hit that bell, hit the little notifications, hit all. And of course, smash the like button. It helps me with the YouTube algorithm. That thing is a tricky thing to master. So with all that being said, I have a link down below to Weeble right now. They up their game. If you have not taken advantage of this, up to $2,300 in free stocks for putting 100 bucks in there. They'll give you two free stocks that could equal $2,300. So take advantage of that. I get one free share. You get two free shares. It's a win-win for both of us. And of course, I do have my link down below to uh, BlockFi right now. If you haven't gotten BlockFi, they're giving you up to 250 in free Bitcoin. Highly recommend taking advantage of this. And of course, on top of that, they're paying you interest. So if you got your crypto somewhere else and you're not getting interest on it, take a look at BlockFi. Highly recommending them. The free Bitcoin and interest that can't be beat. I do have a link down below also to my Patreon. If you'd like to see all the stocks and crypto I'm buying, be a part of our private Discord with thousands of members, this is the way to take it to the next level. Now we're gonna take a look at the top stocks to buy now. These are the ones that I think are gonna do absolutely wonderful moving forward. And I think you have a rough idea what I'm looking for. It's easy to go out there and throw out a million different stocks every time you make a video, but I like to key in on the ones that are gonna make us money. Not just try to give you 1,000 different stocks to give views. I continue to give you what I think are the top stocks to buy now for the future that we can sit back and hopefully get above average returns in the market. These are the kind of stocks that I think when you look three, four, Four years down the road, they could be up a few hundred percent from where they are right now. The first one I got for you, of course, you know which one I'm going to be talking about. This is going to make the list every time. So the first one is NEO, and we are looking into these. I wanted to pick some of the EV stocks today, look into some of those, and see what we have for opportunity. So as we get into these, I'm going to show you a little bit about the price prediction for NEO. And of course, for those who've been waiting, we haven't seen them forever. Tesla Cat is in the studio. Here's for the bears, of course. <laughs> Duck and weave, duck and weave, you got a duck. He's a good cat. That's it for all those waiting to see him. He just got a drink of water. So you'll see his tail wagging around because he likes playing. That being said though, we do have Neo and Neo is around uh, 46, 55 at the making of this. A really good run lately. And if you'll actually look, we were up there around 62 at one point. It came all the way back down and we were down a ton when we're looking at this. We were down about 50%. And then since then, uh, we have climbed back up around 49.10% uh, since that low. But from here, if you actually take a look at the highs, we'd still be down about 25.92% off of that high. With all the things going on with NEO, I do believe you're gonna see a big time run over the next 18 months, and you're gonna see this stock get to new highs. Now hopefully, it'll hit around 60 or higher now, I've been saying for a while that we should be able to count on NEO to get up to around 60 or higher. That would be fair price by the end of this year. I do expect to see it up to about 100, 90 to 100 by the end of next year. And of course, I've thrown out 160 to 180 by the end of 2023. We're getting far enough out there now that we can start looking at some of the future numbers past what we're seeing. And I do expect to see a positive earnings per share by the end of next year. And so that's gonna be big. And I think by 2023, you are gonna see some big time price to earnings ratio because it should be a very positive earnings. So we'll find out with that. That's the first of the top stocks to buy now. These are ones that I think are gonna do very well. And as we move into it, the next of the best stocks to buy now is Tesla, of course. I think this stock is a great price right now for those who are looking, you haven't gotten in, you're thinking about adding a little Tesla stock. This is the time. I do believe that Tesla is looking at a really good price right now. And moving forward, it should start to rebound from some of those lows we, we were seeing. 
and that's what I'm hoping for. And so at this point, it's around 617 a share, and I do believe that we will see this thing getting back up to up to around 900 a share. If we can get the catalyst rolling, this thing can start taking off. No more issues with production from the chip shortage and all that stuff, we'll see some movement. So I am hopeful that we'll see this run up here in the next few months, and that's what I'm gaming for. The next of the top stocks to buy now is ChargePoint. I have liked ChargePoint since I got into this YouTube gig, and I think it has a great chance to continue higher as we move forward. They are a leader in the EV charging industry, and I believe that's not gonna change. But if we look at the six months, you can see we were all the way up, and then of course we got down 56% since then, we have climbed back up to about 47% off that bottom, and I bought all kinds of good stuff. I got leaps on this, we got the stocks, we got all kinds of things, and I do believe you're gonna continue to see this move higher. I thought it should be in the 35 to 40 range by the end of this year, at least, if not getting back up there to some of these highs that we were experiencing in the mid 40s, or the high 40s. So we'll see where it goes, but by the end of this year, that's what I'm shooting for. And I do have, like I said, I have some leap options on this. It expired January 20th, 2023. So that's the next one I got. Of course, if you've been following the channel, you know I just recently added on a bunch of this stock, Xpeng. Xpeng is one of those stocks that are the Chinese EV. They're taking advantage of one of the largest automobile industries in the world. China is one of the largest markets in the world for automobiles, and they are over there taking advantage of it and selling. This thing got beat up real bad too. If you actually look at how much they lost, they were down 58% more than the other ones. And so since then, it has been rallying big time, 80% up. This thing has been moving. It's one of my biggest winners in the last few weeks. The next of the top stocks to buy now, even with an old Tesla cat tail walk in front of us is going to be Lee. Lee is one of the ones that have rallied up. And if you actually take a look at where Lee is right now, you can see that it is up about 49.8% in the last month. It continues to roll up. And I did think that this would have a good chance to roll up when I made that video back there. I think it was around May 13th, May 14th, 15th in that range. We did a video on um, the why these EVs were trading at almost a 12 month low. And now since then, they have rallied since then. And that's when we thought we'd be seeing a new bull run for the EVs. And we are definitely seeing that. No complaints there. But not all stocks are doing well, but this is still one of the top stocks to buy now, in my opinion, Churchill Capital, CCIV. This is Lucid, for those that don't know. Big article out there I'm gonna share with you. It's an interesting thing. For those that have been watching Tesla. Now, I said Tesla's one of the best buys to do now, one of the best stocks to buy now, but take a look at this. Tesla canceled its Model S Plaid plus its 500 plus mile range version. Uh, this is the only, it was the only version capable of rivaling Lucid Motors Air Dream Edition in terms of range. Remember that that Air, that Dream, the Air Dream, can get over 500 miles to a charge. That is big, and that's a big win for Lucid. It says basically, Tesla's saying, okay, you know, that's something that they're going to allow Lucid to be able to brag about that they're getting over 500 miles to a charge. So that was a big win. For Lucid moving forward as they start getting these cars delivered, manufactured, and all that other good stuff. So that's something to watch out for moving forward, and we'll see how that affects CCIV. Now for CCIV, I did expect to see this stock trading back up to the 30 to 40 range by the end of this year, and they have a lot of people shorting CCIV. I'm always wait waiting for either a natural uh, short squeeze where we see a lot of, the, a lot of positive catalysts come out and then everybody who's short has to jump back in. So we'll find out if that is something that happens. So the next thing I wanna do is go over what the analysts of Wall Street think. I just wanna make sure everyone understands that when I look at tip ranks here, they get all the analysts from Wall Street in one place, and they come up with an average based on Wall Street's analysts, okay? So this isn't tip rank saying this is what we think. This is what the analysts down below here think as an average. So they come in and they get them, and you can read how they figure out the price, 
and that's what I look for. I usually like to go with the top analysts and see what they think. And so from here, let's take a look. And for NEO, you can see they have it at 61.10, a 31% upside potential. This is a 12 month price target. And you're probably gonna see more and more updates now that the EVs are climbing. And that is one thing, uh, we'll see what happens. Because when they were crashing, I didn't. it was like crickets out there. You didn't see anyone coming out to go to bat for these. The next one, Tesla, this is one that did get a little bit of love, even during the correction. And you can see at this point, they only have it basically at a 620 price. So this changed a little bit and you can see, but if you go with the top analyst, they have it at 777. And this is something I think is more reasonable. I actually think it's gonna get up to about 900 with a good positive run. This happened before at the end of last year. I said it was at 400, I thought it hit 600. It ended up hitting 800. So there's possibilities of this running in a 60 to 90 day period like we saw last year at the end of the year. So we'll see what happens with this, but the upside potential is 25.84. The next of the top stocks to buy now is ChargePoint. And we can see the analysts have a 30.74 upside potential for this and I'm hoping to see that happen quick. The next one, Xpeng, the analysts out there on Wall Street have this as a 21.36% upside potential. I'm hoping that we can hit a lot more than that because it's been running. But I remember bringing this up when this was like 80 or 90% upside potential at one time and now it has climbed back up. And finally, we have Lee. Lee with the analysts have a 31.73 upside potential and I do believe we're gonna see some big runs in these EVs to continue. So I shared all of the analysts from Wall Street. I'm sharing my price predictions. These are the top stocks to buy now, in my opinion, going forward. And so yes, you will hear me talk a little bit about them. I will continue to find out the catalysts that should move them higher. And of course, I'll be looking for red flags anytime we get some for any time that these stocks could drop in price. I'm always looking for that as well. And now moving on, if you're just getting into these stocks, you haven't been in, you, you sold out and now you're seeing them start to climb back in. You got to do your due diligence. See if you do believe that these stocks are going to continue to climb, that the chip shortage, which we heard all about, is finally over, which I think it is. And then, of course, what quarter should we see outstanding sales and deliveries? I think Q3 is the one. And then, of course, Q4 should be absolutely fine as well. So I think we'll find out through June, through NEO, once they report in July how they did in June, that's going to be a big sign of how we could look at these stocks moving forward for a lot of them. And so I'm pretty excited about it. I continue to buy. I have options on some of these. And they are printing right now. So the money is rolling in for some of these stocks. And I hope it continues to flow upward. So that's what I got for you today. These are the top stocks to buy now for 2021 in my opinion. I think they're gonna continue to roll up. And if you haven't gotten your free stocks from Weeble down below, click on that description. Put $100 in there. You can buy anything you want with that. They're gonna give you two free shares worth up to 2,300, the highest I've ever seen them do. And of course, on top of that, go over to BlockFi, get your free Bitcoin up to $250 in free Bitcoin and on top of they're going to pay you interest and I'm talking good interest rates and that's something you should take advantage of. If you have your crypto somewhere else you're not getting paid that's like telling the stock companies to leave the dividend you don't want it. It doesn't make sense if you're trying to make a lot of money. Uh, of course I do have my link down below to my Patreon as well. Come on over join us it's a good way if I've ever helped you. This is a way to give back to me a little bit to help the old channel. And of course, uh, the tip ranks link is down below as well. We have the private discord over at the Patreon with thousands of members. You can come over and be a part of the community. It's a great place to go for positivity. Now that's all I got for you. Let's get out there and make some money.